Hello everybody. Um now as the title states is Android Development and the Future of Coding Made Easy. Now I'm gonna be saying talking about these two things last because I wanna talk to you guys about other issues first. And I don't want you guys to like care about the Android development stuff and not taking the other stuff of the video. Well, first of all, I have um I, I think I have over 800 subscribers now, so thank all you guys for subscribing to my channel and watching my videos. I really appreciate it. Um, and now let's get into some the lack of videos that have been going up lately. Now I know I have a lot of dedicated viewers that like really look forward to my videos um, on a consistent basis. And I made um, a video on my on my last um, update saying that. I'll be making a video every single day, um, a tutorial every single day for each of my series. Um, there have been a lack of videos now lately because um, it's February now and now it's playoffs for my basketball season at school and because of that um, my team has been practicing every single day, been having a lot of exhibition games um, and stuff like that to prepare us and like since we have like since we're like one of the top teams in Canada like we, like everybody's out to like beat us so we have to like each of us have been like individually practicing hard to really come out when the playoffs starts next week or this coming week so for the whole month of February I'm gonna be really busy with basketball but I'm really going to try and make videos, but if they don't come every day, just please be patient. I'm really trying, I'm trying to find time and stuff, but I just haven't found the time. Also, I, um, with work and stuff, I'm trying to work more and more and more now because now that I have a car, I have to be paying car insurance and stuff, which is pretty expensive. So... Yeah, I had to be working also, which is kind of taking up some of my time. But after the March of February, I should have a lot of time, and I'll be making a boatload of videos for you guys, so you guys can look forward to that. Now, um, let us talk about um the future of Cody Mates right now. Now, um, I recently got accepted to um four colleges. Um, in like four colleges in Canada, and uh, some of you might be saying, "Why aren't you going to university? Why are you going to college? What not? Blah blah blah." I could have went to university, but I chose college for a specific reason. I did it for you guys in mind, and I think it's a better choice for me. Um, if you guys don't know what a college is, college is basically the exact um, college in Canada is basically the exact same as junior college in America, um, and you can still transfer to university, um, selected universities and stuff, um, but instead you don't get an associate degree, you get a um, diploma, much like high school, but it's a college diploma, and you can transfer to um, selected universities that are joined with that certain college so I think a, an associate's degree in America you can transfer to any college that accepts associates any university that accepts associates degrees but um, in Canada it doesn't really work like that but anyways I got accepted on um, one in one college I applied to had a game programming course and I was like maybe I shouldn't do a game programming course like it's too generalized and I won't like have a broad knowledge of programming but I'm doing that because when I look at the courses curriculum and I talk to the teachers there and stuff and the professors and stuff and you really learn like the whole area of game development you work with teams um, you work with modelers with game designers on um, projects you learn how to be like you learn how to like create gameplay programming, GUI programming, level programming. You learn mobile game development, web development. You learn Java, C sharp, um, C plus plus. Use OpenGL, DirectX. Um, 
I think you use UDK also. Like you learn all these stuff within the three years that you're there. And um, I'm thinking like for the future of this channel, I really wanna like what I've been really specifying on is game development. So I really, 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 and I think I'm gonna really enjoy that. And I'm going to be taking that knowledge from my courses or my classes and I'm going to be showing it to you guys. So say I have a math class and I'm learning about 3D vectors or 3D math in class. Then I'll come back after that day, whatever, I'll make a video on it and I'll post on my channel so I can be like a personal log for me. And you guys will basically be learning exactly what I'm learning in college but you guys get it completely free like that's the deal of a lifetime you get game programming course completely free on coding made easy channel you can't ask for a better deal than that so you guys can still get your computer science degrees and all that stuff and still learn about game programming and i will be transferring to university so i will be getting my degree so for all those who don't think that I'm I'm smart if I don't have a degree or whatever. I'm still gonna get a degree. I'm just going a different route or a different route or whatever you wanna call it. Anyways, lastly, last but not least, let's get into Android development tutorials, which you guys, a lot of you guys, have been wanting. Now I told you guys that I was trying to get my hands on the Android before I even started the tutorial series because I want to make apps for myself and if I have my own Android I'd be more motivated to like explore new areas in Android um, development well um yesterday um when I was in school I was just joking around with one of my, one of my friends I'm like I'm like yo do you want to trade my Blackberry for your Android and she's like yeah do you want to trade it right now so I'm like wait are you serious and she's like, yes, I'm serious, let's trade right now because I really want a BlackBerry and whatever. And I, I don't really use the Android anyways. So I'm like, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. So I never traded with her yet. I'm trading it this week coming up because I still have some stuff that I got to do with my BlackBerry. But the good news is that I am getting my hands on an Android. And then you know what that means? Android tutorials coming to you guys very very soon so you'll have you'll be you'll have the ability to make your apps and have them on the go and for those who have android tablets and stuff the the operating system is exact same it's just the resolution is different so when you make your apps you're gonna have to make them with like if you're making it for uh, android tablet then you're gonna have to make the resolution and the screen size different but it's the it's generally the exact same thing. It's basically with C sharp and X and A. When you're developing for the Xbox 360 or for Windows, it's the exact same code basically. You're just modifying the resolution and instead of checking for keyboard input, you're checking for gamepad or Xbox 360 controller input. It's generally basically the exact same thing. So you don't have to worry about that if you have a tablet or an actual Android and for those who don't know um, Android is developed using the Java programming language so I'll teach that and I was researching and apparently you can make Android apps with the C++ language as well so I'm gonna like learn that too and show you C++ programmers how to develop apps for the Android using C++ they still recommend Java but I will show you the C++ approach as well so um that is it for this update i know it's kind of a long <coughs> sorry i know it's kind of like a long video but i just want to let you guys know so you can look forward to tutorials tutorials are going to be coming slow for the month of february but in the future you have android tutorials and in september as soon as i start um in college you're going to be getting basically going to be getting a whole game programming college course for free on coding made easy's youtube channel so don't forget to tell your friends family whoever's interested in programming because this 
channel is going to be the best programming channel on YouTube. Alright? So don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like this video, comment on it, whatever you want. Just thanks for watching this. Hope you enjoyed it. And bye.